on uh, Transnet Pipelines, which is one of the divisions of uh, our country's state-owned enterprise, Transnet, that uh, takes care of a lot of our uh, supply chain logistics and uh, pipelines. 3,800 kilometers is my number of the day, because that's how big their network is. And we've been getting an overview of uh, just what they move um, uh, how much they contribute to the economy, but we want to get a sense, I suppose, of the economic story. Uh, Mr. Gomeda is here on the panel as well. Um, I guess we've got this uh, situation where we've got Gauteng in the middle of the country, mm. and so naturally, where the biggest part of the economy exists, we have to find a way to get fuel there. So, uh, just by mere logic, um, the pipelines business, Transnet, is contributing to the biggest part of the economy in, in South Africa. Put it into context for us. Well, look, uh, the economy is yeah. important. Yeah. And Transnet doing this job, in fact, it's actually quite surprising that mm -hmm. uh, most of it is underground. And basically, they have to put it underground and pray that it gets to join us back. But, but, but that's the technical expertise that Transnet puts into getting you know, this economy moving. You now, you've seen when there's a, a whisper that there'd be a, a petrol shortage at the pump stations, how much panic mm -hmm. that you have in this country. That's how important mm -hmm. this industry is. And most of it happens underground, you don't see it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. So, you know, we, we can, they often say that um, a picture's uh, worth a thousand words. And we've been talking about pipelines, and we've got a sense now that some of it is actually underground. Um, unlike their rails, which you'll see everywhere. Um, but just to give you a sense of uh, what we're talking about, let's just take a quick look at this uh, little clip. It will give you a sense of uh, this uh, network that we're talking about. Transnet Pipelines is an operating division of Transnet SOC Limited, which is owned by the South African government. Since 1965, Transnet Pipelines has owned, maintained and operated a 3,800 kilometer network of underground high pressure petroleum and gas pipelines throughout the eastern parts of South Africa, as well as the infrastructure and property associated with them. The latest addition to the network is a 24-inch, 555-kilometer multi-product pipeline, which includes two accumulation facilities. It is amongst the most complex multi-product pipelines in Africa. We transport various grades of diesel and petrol, crude oil, aviation turbine fuel and methane-rich gas. Our infrastructure includes intake, pump and delivery stations, workshops and maintenance depots. The Talton Storage and Distribution Facility offers road and rail loading, as well as additive dosing. It is mainly used for cross-border deliveries into Botswana. A unique facility at Talton is the refractionator, which processes intermixture and ensures adherence to stringent fuel specifications. Our network of pipelines is of strategic importance to the national economy of South Africa to maintain a continuous and reliable supply of crude and refined products to industry. We transport petroleum products for a number of major clients, while also facilitating new entrants into the pipeline network. Our pipelines are managed, operated and maintained in accordance with all legislation, regulations and international standards. As a result, our safety record is excellent. We have developed our expertise and skills over more than five decades and employ state-of-the-art technology. The pipeline network is monitored and operated from the Master Control Center in Durban via a supervisory control and data acquisition system. Our customers benefit from efficient metering and instrumentation technology 
as well as an effective web-based SAP customer portal for placing and tracking orders. Pipeline integrity and maintenance is vital to our organization. We carry out extensive inspections, maintenance and refurbishments, including cathodic protection of the pipelines and servitude surveillance and management. In the event of an incident, emergency systems and plans are activated and response teams are immediately dispatched to make the area safe and minimize the impact. We are committed to taking our extensive skills, knowledge and expertise in maintaining and operating petroleum and gas pipelines beyond South Africa's borders. Our accredited School of Pipelines, based in Durban, offers a variety of technical and operational courses. For more than five decades, we've played a vital role in our country as a strategic economic driver and an enabler of skills and employment. We are proud of our skilled and experienced teams across all disciplines of the organization and the role we will play in the future development of our continent. So that gives you an overview, uh, perhaps uh, succinctly, of uh, just what we're talking about here. And I heard quite a few things there, not just pipelines, but it's part of a, uh, a bigger network, uh, uh, Mr. Butelezi. It, it is. It is. I think um, as Transnet, it's actually three of our operating divisions that service the uh, petro petrochemical industry. We've spoken about uh, the pipelines. Mm -hmm. Uh, there is Transnet Freight Rail. We run over 1,600 fuel wagons, uh, also from the coast, you know, all the way through to Botswana. Because again, what Transnet pipelines and what we do in this area is not just for South Africa. It is actually for security of supply for the region. And uh, so it is Transnet Pipeline and Transnet uh, Freight Rail, as well as uh, the Transnet National Port Authority. We've got the Island View Precinct right here in Devon which is a huge petrochemical area for imports you know, and exports of our petroleum products. So those three divisions are very key for supporting the petroleum industry in South Africa All and right. the region. We're going to unpack that as well uh, uh, right after this break. So stay with us and uh, we'll continue to explore what this uh, pipelines and transnet uh, uh, contributions to this uh, uh, economy is uh, right after this. Stay with us.